Hey guys, it's Jay. Here is your cane lesson. It's very windy, so I'm trying not to talk too soft. Trying to speak it. Okay, so you're waiting for your trip. Some people hold their cane with their thumb straight up or to the side or this way. Some people hold it this way. I was taught to hold my index finger out like this. So you're waiting for your traffic. Um, here, that's the bus. I just heard the bus. Um, you're waiting for your traffic. You're, so this is like your curb here where this, this line is right here. So you might want to be back a little bit like this because the cars are like right here. Like they might be getting that close to you. So you want to be back a little bit, right? So once it's time for you to start walking, Wait, my shoes are way too big. It's just that I needed a pair of shoes and my feet. I had trouble finding good shoes so I got a bigger size than what I needed. Anyway, I could explain it to you, but it doesn't really matter. Okay, so you're ready to take your first step. So you have your perpendicular traffic here in front of you and to your right or to your left, depending on which way you're, you know, like a straight line going from your back, back line to in front of you here or this way. Here. That's your um, parallel traffic. So when you hear your parallel traffic coming, um, you want to go. The reason you don't want to go with this traffic is you'll be walking out in the midst of traffic. So let's say there's a car like right here. You're going to walk into it. So let's just say like you're, you hear your perpendicular tra your parallel traffic going your perpendicular stop. So so you want to walk, so you get your traffic going, so take a left foot, right, your cane to the right, right foot, cane to the left, so you just walk like this. And of course, the better, the faster you walk, the better the traffic. Since you're out in the street, you don't want to take too long. You wanna hurry across. So let's just do the same thing, okay? With, uh, that was two-point touch, this. Well, it's actually supposed to be shoulder to shoulder or a little past the shoulder, so you could do it here to here if you wanted, but not too far out. So, uh, there's also the, like, the two-point touch, but you're rolling the cane, sort of. So you can do the same thing, see? And I just found this is a way to trail too. If you if you are unfamiliar with where you're going, you can use the cane to tell you to keep you in line if you need that. If you have really bad vision uh, and you can't hardly see, so let's just keep walking. Okay, that's how you do it. That's how you use it. I hope that helps you. I'll talk to you later. Bye.